Edify is excited to announce the launch of the connectivity tools for the Ready instrument and the Magnify software. This new set of tools aims at making collaboration easier than ever during inspection. These tools are currently available on Magnify 5.3 as a trial for any customer with an active software subscription or maintenance plan. In this video, we'll talk about the new mobile app from Edify, which allows you to add context to your data by taking pictures and notes with your mobile phone and then linking them to your inspection, to your data files, and to any indication you may have found. So for the purpose of this video, what I'll do is that I've just inspected this small stainless steel plate here with an iFlex Pro. And what I'll do is that I'll use the mobile app and analyze the data on the ready. And the mobile app is going to allow me to add a lot of context to this inspection, to this small scan, so that I'll then produce an outcome, which is a small report that anybody, uh, even if they have no ID current array background, will be able to understand and appreciate and also trust. So the first thing I'll have to do is to connect my mobile phone with uh, the ready system. And so for that, let's go into the backstage of Magnify, into the connectivity tab. And so the connectivity tab is where we access all of the connectivity tools in which we can interact with them and also configure them. And so we're going to look specifically now to, at the Edify app. And uh, first of all, the Edify app is available on both Android and Apple devices. Uh, to download the app, simply press uh, the app download that you see on the bottom right corner here. And you'll see two QR codes. Uh, one will lead you to the Google Play Store and the other to the Apple App Store. So I've already got the app on my mobile, but to connect, if you're not sure, you can press the connect to app here. It will open a small menu containing indications related to how to connect depending on your mobile device. All right, so now I already have the Edify app installed on my mobile. So I'll open the app and right off the bat, I can see the ready that I'm going to connect to, which is ready AQ4 XDN. To connect to a ready, it's pretty simple. Both the mobile and the ready must be connected to the same Wi-Fi. Or if you don't have Wi-Fi, for example, if you're on site, both need to not be connected to any Wi-Fi. And then you'll be able to see uh, the ready instrument by just standing next to it. So I'll press the ready system. So I'll hit the, bu the ready button. And then it's gonna ask me uh, the connection code, which is the one that's displayed at the bottom. So six, one, two, or in this case, and then I'm connected to the instrument. And what I can see here is the root of my inspection, which I called Edify app for the purpose of these videos. Now I can see that I have one scan available, which is scan 001, which I can see on the left-hand side of the ready screen here. So let's have a quick look at the app. Uh, so the app allows you to add pictures and comments to inspection, scans, and indications. And that's how the hierarchy goes. So right now we can see my inspection folder, which is called Edify app. And inside I have one scan, scan 001. And as you can see, inside the scan, I have zero flag, which means that I don't have any indications that have been added to my report. And I, I don't have any images. If we look next to Edify app, so my inspection project, I see that I have one inspection file, so one data file and zero pictures. So I'm going to remedy to that. I'm going to first, I'm going to start by adding some context to the inspection. So I'll press the camera button here to add a picture of what I'm going to do. And so I'm going to take a picture of the plate that I've inspected. I'm going to press the camera button. I'm going to take a nice picture of the plate that I've inspected. So I press this button. I'll press OK because I'm satisfied. And then I'll add a comment. So I'll say, I have inspected this stainless steel 316 plate. That's okay. And it's going to send the picture directly to my instrument. Now, if I press the uh, picture button, I can see the image. 
I can see the picture and the comment. I'm actually going to add a second picture. Well, I'm going to add a picture of the probe that I use. Here. Press OK. I'll say the inspection was done using an iFlex probe. Send the image. All right, it's a success. If I look at the ready, I can see that two images have been added. I can view them along with the comments that have been taken. I can move around. Uh, I can even do another thing, which is uh, yeah, so I'll move back once. I can see uh, my scan. If I go into the scan here, I'll actually take a screen capture of this whole thing by pressing the capture button. And all of a sudden it will appear on the mobile app. Let's do some analysis now. We have four nice little defects right here that I'm going to add to my report. So I've zoomed on them and we'll label them pit one, two, three, and four. So here I add this pit here. And you'll notice that in scan 001, you can see that indications have started to appear. Anytime I add an indication to my report, Magnify also takes a screen capture. And so I can see those four pits all containing a single screen capture. Now it's time to add some further context. I'm going to take a picture of each of those pitting. I'll also label them physically with a marker. And so let's go to pit number one. I'll go on the camera. Let's see here, here, nicely identified. No need for further comment. The whole thing speaks for itself. All right, now all of these screen captures have been added to my file list that I can see on the left-hand side of the ready. Uh, I can open all of them to have a look, but I'm pretty much ready to build a nice little report now. So I'm gonna head back to the backstage, to the general tab, and I'll hit the generate report button. I won't feel any of this, but I could add more information. I'll hit finish. And so this generates a nice little report in an HTML format. So it's not the report that you might be used to uh, with the ready. And so what we'll do is we'll export the report to my laptop and then we'll have a look at the report. Okay, so now I'm looking at my laptop and uh, I've basically synced this, uh, my whole inspection project by using OneDrive. I'm in the OneDrive repository for, for the ready that I was using. And here I see the, the inspection folder that I called inspection app, uh, edify app. So I'll get there. And here I can see the content of my, my inspection. I can see my setup, my data files, all of the screen captures and pictures that have been taken. And you'll notice a folder labeled report. So I'll double click there. And you'll see report.html here. I'm gonna click on this. And this is the nice little report that Magnify has generated for me. And so on top, we can see the indication table. Uh, we have our four pitting with the positioning, amplitude, channel, and the file that, that they were in. And then if we scroll down, uh, we can see the various pictures that we've taken. So here we have Edify apps, so that, that was our inspection folder. And so tagged to the inspection are those two pictures. So you see that I have inspected the stainless steel 316 plate and that I did this inspection using an iFlex Pro. Here we see a screen capture of the whole scan. And then if I scroll down, we can see uh, the pitting. So I can see the screen capture here and I can see the image here that was taken with my phone. So that's pitting, pit number one. 
Same thing here with bit number two. Screen capture, actual picture, bit number three, and bit number four. So even to someone who's not versed in eddy current arrays, everything that you see here makes the inspection seem pretty obvious as to what happened. All of these things, the pictures, etc., can be copied by using these buttons here. So here I'd be copying the, the pictures linked to the Edify app. Here I could copy uh, my whole list of indication and paste it into Word, into Excel, into uh, anything. And if I'm satisfied with this as, let's say, a preliminary report, I could simply press the little printer button at the bottom right corner to print this whole thing in a document. This would act as a nice little preliminary report. So there are some, some links here that allow you to, if you've got a lot of content, uh, that will not enable you to jump from data files, uh, indications, etc., etc. And so, yeah, that's pretty much it for the Edify app and the report that you can generate using it on the Ready and Magnify system. Yeah.